Dire Wolves versus Wolves Esports, and we're getting ready to go. What they've done is chosen to move sides and coming through the kitchen instead. Really smart idea. They march in and get two kills, and Dire Wolves may well have just found their way into the lair of the Wolves. This is what I was critical of not happening previously. You know, if teams trying to still push oh, good positions night. with two or three guns focused on them, but no, the adaptation and the switch has been fantastic from Dire Wolves. Ray finishes us off with a final kill. They need to be confident, they need to be sure of what's going on, of what they're doing. They're not going to have an opportunity at this rate to get the diffuser down. P4 keeping himself out of dodge. Big kill there, big moment as Shinka gets Ray. Two seconds left to go, just needs to keep himself alive, but no! Seamless somehow manages to find that kill. You can see the frustration among Swolves as a team. Again, at this point, I touched oh, the ball. Oh, 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 really chancing it there, and he goes in for a second peek. It's kind of like an unwritten rule. You go for that second peek. Chances are you're losing your life for Pecan, reminding him of that rule. A couple of these members of Wolves that are sort of overstaying their welcome on the other side of the map. Pecan into another, catches P4, crouch walking around sites. Largely, almost casual from Dire Wolves, to be honest. Yeah. That round. A lot of those kills were just coming in front of the Wolves. They just need to be careful of the movement here because oh. there are enemies deep inside. And that's going to leave us now 2v2, 50 seconds left to go. There's plenty of time for Dire Wolves. They don't have to rush a thing. That's what they spoke about on Cafe. You step too far, I think the Wolves get a bit skittish. Start looking for fights, but Ray's got round behind him there whilst all that focus was on sites itself. A few shots as he tried to move away, didn't actually do any damage. I thought Vibu had hit him, but here comes the final challenge. Ray with the spray down. I'm not sure that the player on the black stairs was aware. He is now, and it's an absolute freebie as Harambe walks down and manages to get the kill in his back. Rise is going to be taken down as well. Oh, that leaves yeah. us now in A4 versus oh, 1. The round is over, and Dire Wolves have got themselves an opportunity on map point.